childhood trauma. Is this something that you have ever had? Do you have a good relationship with your parents? Or are things rocky? Have things been rocky in the past? Childhood trauma. People around my age, around 80% of teenagers up to 20, say that this is something that they've had. And a lot of them use it and talk about it as if it's bringing them down. But I wanna thank my wicked parents because it actually changed my perspective on life. First of all, how are you? I hope things have been good and I hope you've been all right. Childhood trauma. I think this is something that a lot of people have dealt with. Maybe their relationship with their parents isn't too good. Some things happened in the past. It's something that everyone can relate to. You see, my relationship with my dad, amazing. I love him to bits. However, me and my mum, we had a lot of rocky patches. I have an Asian mum, typical Asian mum strictness. And you can imagine how the discipline on that was different to of English culture and it was of Asian culture. And that sent me and mum on a rocky path. We didn't get on well. There have been literally some times where we just wouldn't talk to each other for like more than a year. We just wouldn't talk. We both were just angry at each other, holding this hatred and resentment. She was so, so strict. But now that I've gotten older and I look back, I'm thankful. We, st we talk now, sometimes things are still rocky, but I thank her for what she did because it turned out that I learned a lot from it. You see, we have a choice when it comes to things that are unjust, things that aren't fair on how we're treated. We can either learn from it or we can let it control our lives. The decision is ours. Do you decide to learn and grow from your past or do you decide to sit and always think about it? I want you to ask yourself, when you are facing a stressful or an uncomfortable, unjust situation that's making you feel angry, annoyed, resentful, sad, I want you to think about the choices that you make on how you deal with that. Do you deal with it well? Do you learn from it and grow from it or do you not? You see, my mom was strict, very, very strict. I was taught at a young age to do all the dishes. Mom was out working a lot, so I'd cook my sister food, do the dishes, do the lawn, do the laundry, make sure everything's washed, the house is clean. And if mum came back at night, something wasn't done right. You know, our table manners wasn't great. There was mess. <laughs> Time for the wooden spoon. <laughs> Time for the belt. And I think back and I used to be so angry about how I was living. But now I look back, I'm currently living by myself and I can do the laundry. I wash all my dishes by hand. I clean the house and I do the lawn. And I granted at the time I hated being forced to do all of this. And if I did anything wrong, I would get punished for it. I now know how to do all of this by myself. My house isn't in a bad state, it's always clean. When I go out in a restaurant, I have good table manners. Whereas I see other young, like typical iPad kids <laughs> sat on the table with their phones and gadgets, making a mess. I'm sat there like, damn, thank you, mom. I've grown up and I don't make a fool of myself at the table. Every time I go on a date, I have good table manners. I'm polite. I hold the door open. At the time, it built up resentment between me and my mum, but now I've learned from everything. I decided to look at my past childhood trauma, and I decided to learn from it, rather than let it control my life, rather than always thinking of the bad, the resentment, how it made me feel at the time, instead of focusing on the good, the positives, the things that I learned from it, because I did learn a lot. Yeah, there were some times where things were hard, really hard, to the point where I was out the house. I was living with dad, wasn't living with mum anymore. We wouldn't talk to each other. Times were hard, but I just want to thank her. I want to thank mum and I want to thank dad. Yeah, times were tough in the past, but I have learned a miraculous amount from it. Two years ago, you would have never caught me ever saying that. You mentioned my mum to me, I'd be like, ah, oh, fucking bitch, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> Two years ago, I would have never ever thought of saying this, but which is better? The fact that I'm able to sit here now and thank her, that I've learned from everything, or the fact back then that I was so angry. I don't know, but I know for sure that I would not have this big of a smile on my face two years ago talking about this. I feel good and I've learned a lot. I don't know, maybe maybe this helped you out. I hope it did. I hope things have been all right. And I, I really do hope that this video has given you a new perspective. Times can be really hard and it can be really hard to see the outcome of things. 
But it's your choice. You're the one who gets to choose how you react to things. Whether you can learn from it or whether you don't. I hope you've been good. And I, I hope life is okay, man. And I hope this video helped. And I would be really appreciative if you clicked on the one that's going to pop up in the corner. Because this video could help you out as well. And subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Stay consistent and do the best you can. You know what time it is? Give me it. Self-improvement kiss. Mwah.